Tonight in Monroe, city leaders voting to continue having private events or shows the city-owned Dowd Theater. Our WCNC Charlotte Austin Walker learned of efforts by some to stop one show in particular, so he pressed for more understanding. Austin has more on the debate tonight. We get to do our event. The show must go on at the Dowd Theater. And that's what we want to do on March 22nd is do our event. Next week, through funding by the North Carolina Arts, Crystal Robinson, the president of Union County Pride, says it will put on the show Hello Daddy. It's a play about a um, drag queen auditioning <laughs> um, for plays. It's been promoted and tickets sold. She says the organization went through the right avenues to put it on. We did the paper online. All of that jazz that we're supposed to do for everybody else. Something Pete Havanek, the Monroe Tourism Director, assured us. We would come to terms on a date and a, and a cost for their event. But some in Monroe believe the material being performed is inappropriate. I do think we need to step in and I do think exposing children to this kind of thing is abuse. WCNT Charlotte learned and was confirmed by Council Member Franco McGee. Some on the City Council wanted to suspend all contracts performed at the Dowd Theater, including Hello Daddy. I'd like to make a motion. Friday, after a closed session, the Monroe City Council reconvenes, looking to vote to suspend all performances. But instead, Council Member Julie Thompson says something some didn't expect. Rental, private rental events on the 2024 calendar of the Dow Theater to remain. Uh, and also consider a pause on any additional events being added to the 2024 calendar. In response, some council members saying a decision is being made with safety in mind. And before the vote, Mayor Robert Burns in a last minute plea to the council to vote in opposition to the motion. The possibility what this opens up is, I believe, detrimental to the city and the progress that we, that we are making. Saying, quote, this is not a wise decision. Motion and a second. In a vote, the council agrees to honor the current private contracts, like Hello Daddy. Catching up after with Councilman Franco McGee, who voted to honor the current private rental contracts. Realize that we serve all people um, and make sure that everybody is safe. Though McGee does say he does support a rewrite to the current contract to assure the safety of everyone. But while the show must go on, some like Michelle Ball are unhappy with the decision by how some voted. There's so many people that um, you think are conservative and that you think love the Lord and you think that want to protect kids, they didn't vote to do that. In Monroe, Austin Walker, WCNC Charlotte.